everyone. First of all, I want to congratulate all the NEET qualifiers who have successfully got into Medical College for MBBS. Congratulations and I am wishing you the best ahead. Before continuing with the video, please subscribe to my channel and like and share this video. So all of you are excited for college. I guess the colleges are starting from February. So the first thing that happens out of this excitement is that you buy books. I have experienced this. Now, there are three subjects in first year MBBS, Anatomy, Physiology and Biochemistry. So in this video, I am going to tell you the books used for studying Anatomy. I am going to tell which books you can purchase and which books can be used from library or from seniors or you can download PDFs. Now the anatomy whole subject is in four divisions, general anatomy, gross anatomy, embryology and histology. Let's start with general anatomy. There are these two books for general anatomy, one by B.D. Chaurasia and other by Vishram Singh. Content in both is given in simple language, but Vishram Singh is little more content, especially in systemic anatomy and genetics. I have used Vishram Singh. You can buy anyone. Then comes gross anatomy. In gross anatomy, basically there is upper limb, lower limb, abdomen, pelvis, thorax, head, neck, face and neuroanatomy. These are all the portions of gross anatomy. Now most of the content of the anatomy subject is in this division. Again here there are two options. One is B.D. Chaurasia and another is Vishram Singh. B.D. Chaurasia is set of four volumes and Vishram Singh is set of three volumes where the neuroanatomy is separate. Now content wise both books are more or less the same. BDC is actually the gold standard book in India. Like if you ask doctors that which books they have used, then it's BDC. Book is actually comprehensive, whereas Vishram Singh is kind of straightforward or point wise. It is a time saving book and the diagrams given are easily reproducible in exams. Again from last year, that is 2019, the MBBS curriculum is changed. It's more practical or clinical based than theoretical. So, clinical anatomy is important. Both BDC and Vishram Singh have given clinical anatomy, but Vishram Singh has more content in it. Also, what Vishram Singh has done is it has given clinical aspects of the topic just below the theory of the topic. So, it's very easy to go through. So, overall, you can buy BDC or Vishram Singh as 90 to 95% content is same in all standard books. But keep PDF of the other book with you. I have used Vishram Singh. For Neuroanatomy, which is a part of Gross Anatomy, BDC is better and concept building. Then there is Dissection. For this, you need Dissection Manual. So there is Cunningham books available. No one actually reads the theory in these books. They are used for instructions for dissecting the cadaver. But some of the parts like peritoneum and all, they are given nicely in this. So, uh, instead of purchasing new books, you can get it from your seniors. Moving on to the next division, that is embryology. In embryology, you study development of fetus or how we are born. Here in India, two authors are well known. One is I.B. Singh and another is Vishram Singh. I.B. Singh is Inderbir Singh book. Now both books are almost same. You can buy any one. I have used I.B. Singh. I.B. Singh is an adequate book. But if you want more, if you have more interest in embryology, it can also help in gynecology and ob subject. So you can also refer to foreign author book that is Langman's Embryology. And now the last division, Histology. In histology, we see microscopic anatomy of tissues and organs. This is required for histopathology slide reading in second year. For this, IB Singh book is sufficient. You can purchase it. The atlas given at the start of the book is really helpful for your practical examinations also. Apart from these textbooks, 
there are review books which are helpful for PG entrance exam. There are two options available, Arvind Arora and Dr. Rajesh Kaushal. Most of the students buy Dr. Rajesh Kaushal review books. Now, if you are studying anatomy, you need to see diagrams to understand or image up the theory given in the textbooks. So you can use Atlas. Netter's Atlas is wonderful. You can purchase it. Otherwise, there are apps having Atlas or 3D Anatomy. Of course, you have to do in-app purchases. Whichever suits you, you can use it. The links of the books discussed till now are now given in description. So this is all for anatomy books. I will also put up videos for physiology and biochemistry. You can put up queries or suggestions in comment section. Thank you.